felt this particular project actually went across not just one town but the whole region of Hauraki and it had uh, economic benefits right through the district and it wasn't just centred right around town and it was really sustainable. The project really was a 74 kilometre rail trail on the railway line and it's a cycle trail a lot of people walk in on it as well but it is a cycleway uh, predominantly but as I say through the Gorge Park we get a lot of walkers and it's right next to the Department of Conservation walkways anyway uh, in that area and it went from Thames through to Pyro through to uh, Waihi and through the famous and uh, beautiful Kringahat Gorge and an extension to uh, Tiarawa. So it went into uh, four towns and it's close regionally uh, to Auckland and Hamilton and uh, Bay of Plenty. So uh, yeah, and it's got the famous tunnel uh, that people love, uh, over a kilometre, one and a half kilometres long, and they, uh, it's a bit dark at times, but it's uh, it just adds to the experience. What has surprised us has been the amount of spend. So over 100, about $105, $106 per person is spending each day they come onto the trail. And it's really added some real economic benefits, way beyond we believe so year two we've already exceeded year five predictions our biggest problem now to be honest and it's a good problem to have but it's a problem and that's the sheer numbers in parts of the trail we are getting huge numbers on them and uh, yeah it's been a great project